yesterday we told y'all that we was going to do a box opening. She's here. Yeah, she's here. She came in today. Uh, I want to tell y'all that I knew she was coming today because this morning I had a dream. And in the dream there was a black shadow. I couldn't see this this being's face. But it said, I'm coming I'm on my way. I'll be there today. And I woke up. So we got an uh, EVP recorder going. That way, if we hear anything as we're opening the box and talking to her, but it's just there. It's not like we're asking her to say anything. Or it could come from one of these uh, girls. Yesterday, we shot a video. Yep. And there was light from all three dolls. And one orb shot out of Lily. We slowed it down. So when we get that video up, I've tried to edit the video and things went crazy yesterday. And she was coming in the house this morning, yeah. and my dog Shiloh bit her. Now, her dog has never bit me, never even offered to bite me. Usually comes up to me wiggling, happy. I could not believe it. Then her husband gets out of the car because she left her drink in the car, and she was trying to bite him. Yeah. Anyways, we've done cut the tape off the side of the box. Big and, things come in small packages. Yes, and I've been talking to her. I talked to her and told her that I had to go get a shower, and I told her about my family. And I told her about Fury, and uh, she knows she's going to be a YouTube star. <laughs> she knows she's going to be up here with her sisters, and I've told them about her. So, uh, we're going to see if we how this goes, if we catch any orbs. But look at our other video that talks about, I'm going to uh, name it, buying a doll off eBay that's haunted. And I'll point it out when the orbs shoot through her after I see them. And it's the first um, couple minutes of the video. So yeah, it's not very long into it because I think it was right after we introduced them. Yes, I, I think it was right after. And y'all watched that video and y'all can see my son's seen three and there's three dolls. Yeah, so I think it was one for each doll. Yeah, Lily's was the strongest. Yeah. Hers was, but I've had Lily the, the longest. And like I said, Lily, I do believe, clicks the bathroom light off and on on me. I don't know how that entwines if that's Lily or not, but... She's been in my bedroom, and she's never been brought out. And when I started getting other girls, I brought her out. Yeah. I believe she's the strongest, and that little girl's pretty strong, too, because every time... Oh, well, let's turn around and look at them. Do you get any feelings when you look at any of them dolls? I get a feeling off her. She's the I one... Really do. Yeah, she's the one that gets me the strongest feeling. It's a little bit off her and her, but it's mostly her. She's the strongest, yeah. I believe. I love her dress. Isn't that a pretty color blue? Yeah. That is a beautiful blue. I really do love that. I do too. And anybody, and whoever had her, you can tell she's old because her hair is kind of sticky. You know, like if somebody had a lot of dust in her house. Yeah. So I'm going to try to wash her hair and wash her clothes and, and wipe her off. But they say not to clean them because I've heard that that takes away from them. So maybe you shouldn't. Maybe so, you shouldn't let her be. Yeah, I'm, I'm kind of And then her, she that. actually came with her own extra outfit. I thought that was cute. And a letter from the previous owner. That letter's in that box of her beside you. We'll let y'all see that letter in the little box. Now, the story to her, when I was a little girl... Here's the little box. Yeah, when I was a little girl, do y'all remember those things called green stamps when you went to the grocery store? Isn't that cute? Yeah. And then, you know, her extra little outfit. And then in the drawer, she's got some puppy metal hair, which I guess, you know, like she played a veterinarian. Yeah. She's got a little brush for her hair. You mean to hold it? Yeah. I can get it out. She's got a little brush for her hair. And she has this letter. Okay, show them the letter. The letter says owner. I don't know if you can see that or not. The light shining on it. But it says owner. And it says, Dear owner, this is a very special doll. She has been in my life for as long as I can remember, which is over 10 years. Her name is Anne Marie. Take good care of her, son, previous owner. So she's pretty old. Yes. Because I think she was in the family and was just passed down. That's what I think. Yes. That's what it makes it sound like. Because, see, these were bought with the green stamps. Like I was saying, when you went to the grocery store, you would get stamps when you bought your groceries. And there would be a book. And you would put them stamps in that book. And when you got you a bunch of books filled up, there was a, actually a store that you took the books to. And you could only buy from that store with the green stamps. My granny got me one of these when I was little with well, the green cool. stamps. Yeah. So, she she was a green stamp doll. Because I had one of these when I was little. 
That is, I just seen an orb go by right here. Yeah. Y'all pay attention. I seen something go by right here. Um, but yeah, she's a green stamp doll. But I mean, that's cool. But I feel like not to leave her in here because this reminds me of a coffin. It does look like a coffin. I'm sure she likes to be out and about and see what's going on. Yeah, yeah, and I don't want her standing here not being able to see anything. But that's the story to her. And yes. there is no stories to Lily and uh, Miley. I don't know nothing about their background. I do believe Lily's pretty she old. She closed her eyes. Is she? Yeah, you might have to pull that back in. Yeah, it looks like it's kind of... Okay, guys, um, we're fixing to do the box opening. She still, she folded down in there. All right. They, they packed her good. See, they did look. pack her well. She's little. I hope she comes with a letter. Did you say she was a ballerina doll? Yeah, she's a ballerina doll. So she's going to be delicate. She come with no letter. I wanted a letter. Maybe there's a letter in it. Okay. Sometimes I come with letters in them, I think. Yeah. And it's in here, in with her. She's little, guys. She is really tiny. Yes. No, I don't see no letters. Like I said, I know she's supposed to be, I think, a 38-year-old girl that got murdered by her boss. That had a crush on her, and she turned him down, and he murdered her. So, that's the story. Oh, she's beautiful. Oh, she is. She's so pretty. Her head even moves. Oh, here, show them. Isn't she gorgeous? She's beautiful. Little girl, I don't remember your name. We're going to have to name you. I keep getting Ava for yeah, some reason. I was going to say something with an A. Yeah, so, Ava. Ava. We're going to name her Ava. Hi, Ava. I love the way her little hair is fixed. It's cute. It looks Dutch. She looks like she's crying. Look at her eyes. She does. She looks sad. She looks like she's crying to me. She looks See sad. that left eye? Yeah. A little watery. Mm-hmm. The feeling when I get when I hold her, it kind of seems like there is something there. Hold her theory. Oh, she's weighted. She's got a little bit of weight to her. Yeah. Something tragic. I feel tragedy. It's something absolutely horrible. Her little arm looks like it's broken right on the side. No, that's just the way she's made. Yeah, that's because where she can move her little arms. So she's safe. I feel sad when I hold her. Like, like she went through something really horrible. It's a little dress. I'm excited. I'm a little shaky. Yeah. We're all taking this in. We're sorry that we're taking our time. Sorry, but not sorry. Right. Because if she has a spirit in her, we're trying to be really respectful to her. Yes. She does seem sad. Doesn't she? She does. She seems sad. Not necessarily crying. But just really sad. Like she's really sad. And could y'all imagine if she had, what well, she had a previous owner, and that life that she lived there, and then all of a sudden being given up to somebody else, and her not knowing us. Right. She's had her own family, her own memories, I guess. You know, her own things surrounding her, and then just all at once she's up and packed up in a box. I mean, like, how would you feel if you're sitting on your couch, living your everyday life around your family, people you know, and then all of a sudden they just grab you up? stick you in a box, and ship you off to somebody you don't know. That yeah. would be kind of strange. You know, you, you've got to get used to it. It doesn't just happen overnight. Yeah, and plus, if she is what they say she is, she was human one time. Yeah. I love her hair. And that reminds me of Dutch. Like the Dutch, I uh -huh. guess, uh, Danish? Danish, yeah. The Danes. And where did, where did, did, where did they say, where did we say she came from? Uh, Vermont. Okay, yeah, she came from Vermont. So maybe she was made in, um, Dane. I don't know what Dane. I don't know. Where it's like, um, because I look at her hair, how it's got the little braids on each side. Yeah. So, you know, a lot of people, a lot of Danish people have their hair up like that. 
So I guess like Switzerland because Swiss. Uh huh. Let's hold her up a little bit more and see if, if we can. Uh, sorry, little girl. I want y'all to get a good look at her. Hang on. Say hi to the camera, Ava. You're going to be a YouTube star. Definitely. So this is Ava. And see her little backside. I feel a lot of, a little bit of anxiety. Hope that ain't in your eyes. I feel a little bit of anxiety holding her. Nervousness. Yeah. I need somewhere to put Maybe that's why I was a little shaky. Yeah. Maybe I misread it. Because I do have anxiety. So maybe I read her anxiety as my anxiety. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it could be. But you're really, really cute. You're the little girl. And see, I have to really make sure that she's a, in a safe zone up here because I don't want her to fall off. Right, and she's glass. So maybe we can tuck her right there in front of her. Yeah. So that way she's there and her big sister is help holding her up. Yeah. Don't want her to stay. Right, and that'll be safe. She's going to be able to see right there. And she's kind of looking down. There we go. Is that good? I don't know. Is there any way to make her... You can't like, pop her head up or nothing. Is that her... Her legs bend. She oh, can see it. Oh, good. She can sit there and lean against her seat. Yeah, yeah. There, now she can see it. Yeah, her face. Her face is like it's her hair. Yeah. But see, yeah, now you can sit right there, little girl. Yeah. Well, you're a grown woman. But she's just in a little girl body, I guess. Yeah. I like that. Because the little doll looks like she's about five years old. Yeah, see but how little she is? But if the story's right, you know, like we had said, a 38-year-old woman was uh, tragically murdered by someone in her family, wasn't it? No, she was murdered by her boss. That's right, it was her boss. Yeah, yeah, her um, her boss had a crush on her, the story goes, and uh, she uh, rejected his offers, and he killed her. That's so sad. That is sad, that is really sad. Now... I was thinking she was in her, I think she was 38. If I'm wrong, I apologize. But, you know, you read it, and you read, so I read a couple. And then you go back and read her one more time, and then you, they ship her, and then you don't get to see her story again, unless they mail the story to you. Right. That's all you get to see about her. I think they her. should have wrote her story down. Like, yeah. Write it down and send it with the doll. Yeah. I'm sorry, guys, we keep having to stop, but my soon-to-be daughter-in-law had went outside, and the dogs kept barking. Yep, and then she come back in, and they went off again, but it's okay. Then she let Shiloh in, the dog bite her, so yeah, I, I was worried. Yeah, I think she's all right. She don't seem very vicious or nothing. She's, she's back to her old happy self. Yeah, and so, it, yeah. I don't know, just a momentary relapse or something. I don't know. I don't know, but I have a big German Shepherd, and he, he's sitting between Fury and Shiloh. I'm sorry, guys. I, I'm being protective. Shallows came over she's here. She's being okay. See, she's okay. Okay. Hers okay. See, she's back to her lovable self. She's petting her now. It's the weirdest Hi, thing. Baby. Shallow be nice. Hi, puppy. Hers gonna be fine. So crazy. She's not even growling or nothing. Her smells my kitty cat. Weird. But that's it for today, and we will listen to the EVP recordings. If we catch anything, we'll post it so y'all can hear it. And um, I guess that's it for today. And we'll see y'all later, my little freak squads. Bye, guys.